Man. Um. Let's put a dirt on it.
You said timpanies. He, are you talking about the other song? I definitely wouldn't put timpanies in here. Even though it sounds like one. Say Uncle Ron. It's Uncle Ron now. <laughs> oh. Probably would repeat that and take that one out. I'll take both of those out. Yeah, this to be this could be the end. We got a full song, guys. Two minutes and uh forty. Yep. We good. That's in the bucket. We done. We done. So I was doing two things. Like we created the beat and then I was doing some sound design I guess. Kind of tailoring tailoring it. Um Yeah. So we good. We good right there. That's it right there. And 
and then maybe introduce that back in there. So like after this hook. That's it. We bouncing this joint and we out of here. <laughs> That's how the cookie crumbles. That's what it is. We done with that joint. It's out of here. Ripetochi. We created a full beat on the stream. I don't do that often, but appreciate that, Rich. Thanks for the thumbs up, by the way. Those of you that are still watching. Um, yeah, the beat is solid. Beat is ready for radio. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. That's that's how it's done. Um, so that's that's how you do that. So to recap, what we did was we started with a with an eight bar loop. We kind of build on that, and then how do you break away from the the beat block? How how do you move forward? I just showed you how to move forward. And I guess I should have called this the master class. But uh, it's it's real simple. Once you start duplicating, duplicate a few times, you know, and then start taking things away. And then as you start doing that, it'll come to you. It, it is, it'll be more like a vibe. It'll start, you know, you, you can kind of feel. And that's kind of what we did there. Like, I started the intro short. I'm like, nah, it need to be, it feel like it need to be longer. So as you you play this stuff over and over and and then it's like you you kind of get a gist of what should happen you know what i mean and it also goes along with the knowledge of understanding song structure you know what i mean following song structure so so for you guys that 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 has that issue just i i, I just encourage you to listen to listen to some of your favorite tunes and it, and listen to what's going on, you know. Listen to how long the intro is. Listen to how long the verse is. Count, you know. You got to count that stuff. How long is the is the is the uh, the hook? Is there a pre-chorus there? You know, a pre-chorus usually is the part that plays before the the hook. It sounds like the hook, but it's not the hook. It, you know what I mean? It's like that piece always happens before the hook. And a lot of times the the lyric will will say that. It's like the lyric will say the same thing. Okay, here's the hook. You know what I mean? So that's a pre hook or a pre chorus. The verses are different, but like the second verse goes in and then when the second verse is done, is they finna say the same thing, sing the same thing, rap the same thing. It sounds like it's a part of the hook, but it's not. Or it is, but it's the pre. It's a pre to the hook and then the hook happens. So you got to look at that as well. You got to look at break points where the music drops, you know, where it's like, you know, because they're doing that now. The music actually drops and it's like a break point where it's like, just like what I did here. Like, it's, it's like, like, you know, a little silent stuff, just bells playing, piano, whatever, strings, whatever, right? And, and, and then, then the hook comes or the pre-hook might come back again. Um, the outro is could be hard it can it can end hard or it can a lot of times in modern music they're ending their songs a little softer like that it's almost like reintroducing the the intro but put variation on it or whatever so we kind of did that here each song is different unique but you know and th and that's how you do it you, you break away from that that beat block 
where do I move from here? That's that's it's simple. It's, that's that's all I can say. I'll do more of these. Um, this is like I say. This is how I used to do music when I first started. I did it this way, structure my stuff like that. But I've gotten to the point where I know what I want the intro to sound like, and then I go take that and build on that for a verse. Take that verse, put the the intro back behind the verse, and then take the the verse part because the verse already started building. I'll take that and build on that for the hook sex section. You know what I'm saying? And then go from there. So I, I, I kind of already start putting stuff in place. But on the stream, what we did was we came with a hard bang beat. We came with the attack. It was punching. It was like, bam, it's, 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 we started out with a chorus, so to speak. So that's that's how that's done. Anybody have any questions? <laughs> I'm taking questions.